Hello and welcome back to the Tools Month. In this video today we will talk about the ring resizer. So this is a very very popular tool because when you have a ring like this one and just in a few clicks do you want to resize it? We have this amazing tool that you can find it in the Tools tab under the ring resizer name. So let me just activate it. Now very important, anytime that you want to resize one ring we always use the ring rail as our base. All right, so this is the base that we use to know what is the finger size that we need to start from. So let me show you. If I just select everything, but I am select the ring rail, all right, and I just bring it here, it's telling me please include a valid ring rail in the selection. So now, if I select everything and I add it here, now it already detects that there is a US number seven, and we can go ahead. So if it's a number seven, I want a number eight, eight and a half, six and a half, and six, nine, nine and a half, and ten and ten and a half. I can save it to a file, I can add it to a document, now I will add it to the document, but also important, I want to adjust the angle because I want to keep the setting as it is, because even I keep changing the size, I don't want this to transform, I only want to transform the ring part, all right, the shank, I don't want to transform the setting because then I would have some problems with fitting the gems in the setting. If you want to change the mesh settings, because the output that we will have is a mesh, uh, so you can do it from here. I'm okay with what we have. I just did the angle. So now it's time just to resize the ring. And there we go. So in just one click, I get all these different sizes and always keeping the setting the same that it was so we can fit the stones and we have all the different finger sizes so as i said at the very beginning a very convenient tool to use on a daily basis when resizing your rings so i hope you like it thanks for watching